How is our debt going to be divided in a high asset divorce? Attorney David Bliven explains. In a typical divorce, debt is divided equally. Obviously, if some of the debt with one particular party is associated just with their own expenses, you may be able to argue that some of that debt should be considered their own separate debt. It works a little differently in a high asset divorce case because a lot of the time, the assets came about through the efforts of one party versus the other. One party makes very significant income. Sometimes, even with high income cases, there is still credit card debt. If one party has very significant income and the other party, for instance, has very little income or no income, there is an agreement that the debt will be paid out of assets. Or, if there is some sort of compromise on either spousal maintenance or child support, then the higher earning spouse will assume the debt. Anything like that is subject to negotiation and is case specific. In all matters, we strive for resolution. Yet if no agreement can be reached through negotiation or mediation, we will thoroughly prepare for trial. We tailor our representation to meet the needs of your case.